are in Chappaqua, New York. This is where the Clintons live, right up the street. And Hillary Clinton is here today trying to recuperate from pneumonia. What's a day like today like for you? Or haven't seen Hillary Clinton all day, so it's really just this pulling of teeth to try to get the latest scrap of information. Sure. We didn't know, for example, that Hillary Clinton saw a doctor on Friday. We have no idea. Um, and I think that's part of why it's been such a, there's been such a focus on what are they saying, what are they doing. It turns out she's pneumonia. Something that most people have had some experience with. I've had pneumonia. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. I live to tell the tale. But in the event that everything goes horribly wrong, there are reporters there who are able to document it and able to tell the American public, hey, this is what's going on. So this is the press pool who are responsible for reporting any news that occurs here. This is what they have to do. They got to sit here all day just in case, you know, a doctor comes out with some news. The press used to be able to get up pretty close to the house. Now they've got barricades up so the traffic can't even drive up the street. We're on the street. We're not on the property. We're in the street with people traffic. I don't want to go into semantics with you folks. I'm trying to be civil about it. But can you guys talk to your bosses? I mean, we got to do our job too, you know? I understand. That's not the you want to sit in the blacktop I'm there fine with that. next to the I'm trees. fine with that. Yeah, we have to, sure. I'm fine with that. That's what you got to do to keep your boss happy. You're not giving us the freedom of speech here. You're not doing your job. It's ridiculous. That's America here. It's not Russia. It's America. Watch yourself. Just one week ago, Hillary Clinton was getting points for letting the press in, get closer, and now we're going just back the other direction again. Uh, look at us, we're putting ourselves in danger <laughs> just for freedom of speech, you see? The press, united, will never be defeated. The press, united, will never be defeated.